Starting this week, NDOT will install the first intersection conflict warning systems throughout Indiana. They are designed to improve safety at dangerous intersections throughout the state. One of these systems will be placed in Vigo County. Demetrius Sanders joins us now with what this means for drivers. Demetrius. Mike, representatives with NDOT say by using this system, which is brand new to the state, they hope to reduce serious crashes at some troublesome intersections. Over the years, the area near the intersection of Evans Avenue and US 41 in northern Vigo County has been the location for several wrecks, some which have ended with tragedy. It's a dangerous intersection no matter what time of year. If you're trying to merge on, you're looking over your left shoulder, you could run into somebody or oftentimes you got the blind spot, it's hard to see. Beginning this week and continuing through spring of 2021, NDOT will install intersection conflict warning systems at 17 locations in Indiana, one of those being at Evans Avenue in US 41. The traffic engineers and that, you know, they were seeing a higher uh, crash rate at these intersections. When installed, signage and yellow flashing lights will alert drivers on both intersecting roads that traffic is approaching or that a vehicle is waiting at a stop sign. The lights will be triggered by a vehicle detection mechanism underneath the pavement. The system is a first for Indiana, but it is expected to yield positive results. Federal Highway, according to them, it reduces severe crashes by up to 20 to 30 percent. And Kern says he does believe that the new system can make an impact. What NDOT's doing to help create that awareness by getting those flashing um, signals out there, that's going to make a huge difference. But first and foremost, people need to pay attention. Now, Calder says while work did begin this week in some parts of the state, the system is not expected to be installed in Vigo County until possibly the spring. Mike.